Stolen guns are still an issue in Mobile, and the city is pleading with people to lock up their weapons. Now, last weekend, investigators tell Fox 10 News one officer survived a barrage of bullets from a suicidal man, but the gun they say he used was stolen. So we wonder just how many of the guns MPD seizes after crime are snatched out of unlocked cars, for instance. Well, Fox News' Tyler Finger now joining us live with what he found out. Tyler? Byron, the number of guns Mobile police officers are taking possession of is on the rise. A small number are stolen, but that's not a good thing. Stacked up and on display for our camera, these are most of the guns Mobile police officers seized in June, 177 in all. This is typical of what we find uh, that, that we come in contact with on, on a daily basis. The majority are evidence in crimes. Lieutenant Lewis Screws is the commander of MPD's gun intelligence unit. I have seen just on a normal month an uptick on the number we, we are seeing coming in. Because usually we'd average about 1,200 a year, which is about 100 a month, and now I think we're closer to 1500 a year. More guns are ending up in evidence lockup as MPD sees an increase in violent crime. So far this year, there have been 32 murders in the port city. We're seeing more and more people settling disputes with firearms. A portion of the guns that come in are stolen weapons. In June, they recovered 16 used during a crime, which is roughly a quarter of the number reported stolen that month. Lieutenant Screws says most guns are taken from cars and then end up being used in crime. People will leave them open in a locked car. Well, that's just you know, candy for someone to come through, break a window and snatch it out. As police sees more guns after crimes, that's an added chance that officers could be put into harm's way. We train is there's always one gun on the scene. The one gun being ours. We know about that one. We don't know about these. And that's the that that's the unknown that we, we that that makes us so dangerous. Police say more often than not, stolen guns will be used to commit crimes. They are asking everyone to keep their guns locked up when they're not in use. Live in Mobile tonight, Tyler Fingert, Fox 10 News.